Ladies and gentlemen, survival of the fittest with the most expensive tower we will ever use. It's your boy, the super monkey. All right, let's see just how much he costs, first of all, before we jump into a custom game to allow for the extra money. I think it's 2,700, but we're just going to double check. 2,700. There it is. All right. So, let's edit our challenge. 2,700. Now, this one's going to be an interesting one. Mainly because... Oh, actually, we'll, we'll, we'll just find out. I'll, I'll let you guys figure out why it's going to be an interesting one. But, there it is. 2,700 to start off with. Nothing extra. Let's get into it. Alright, so obviously Super Monkey costs a lot for a reason. We definitely don't expect this guy to fail anytime soon. And if he does, then holy shit, what a waste of money. There we go. Okay. That's, that's looking pretty nice. That's looking pretty nice right there. So, here's the thing that I was worried about with the Super Monkey. We need roughly, what, four grand? Like 450 to be able to buy Ultra Vision before round 24. And then, on top of that, we need a, either a different Super Monkey or the same Super Monkey, and we need Plasma Blasts to pop LEDs. So, because this guy can't pop LEDs, right? To my knowledge, he can't pop LEDs. So, here's, here's the tricky part, is that Super Monkey's fucking expensive, man. I'm expecting a very low round for this guy, either because we can't afford the camera detection time, or because we can afford it in time, just barely, but we can't afford to get laser blasts and plasma shots, or plasma blasts, uh, for the LEDs a few rounds later. Literally a few rounds later. So, I don't think it's personally going to be looking very good for us. I think we're looking at a pretty hilariously shit situation for the Super Monkey here. Uh, imagine starting with a Super Monkey on round one and on round six, sorry, and not being able to beat round 24 with it, or round 28. And there's also a bit of a catch-22 here, because... Like I said, Super Monkey upgrades are expensive as shit. But on top of that, if we get this guy to camera detection, and then to save money instead of buying another Super Monkey, we just go for Plasma Blasts on this guy, there's a massive problem in that once we get Laser Blasts, this guy can no longer pop Purple Balloons. And so we might be able to defend against camo balloons, and then we might be able to defend against lead balloons, but if there are purple balloons right after that, we are legitimately screwed, and that is kinda hilarious. All right. I think we might actually make it to camo balloons. It is quite possible. It's just this round and the next round. This round should give us enough. Oh, no way. Can these blue balloons save us? No, they can't. <laughs> oh, my poor boy. Oh, no. What is that? Like, $84 off? No, $86 off. Oh, I salute you, Super Monkey, but sadly, you ain't it, bud. You ain't it. All right. And there is no disputing that either. I bought nothing else. One Super Monkey... One bottom path upgrade, and we're just a little bit short. So, thank you all so much for watching. Super Monkey's a bit overrated in this challenge, at least. And I will see you all in the next one. Take care, everyone.